Hi, I'm Anne from Game Like a Mother. Today I'm going to show you how to play Dose by Mattel. It's ages seven and up, two to four players, and it takes just a few minutes to play around, and you play until you reach a certain amount of points. Let me show you how. The goal in Dose, just like in regular Uno, is to be the first to get rid of your hand of cards. At that point, you get to total up the points from your opponent's hand, and whoever has the most points at the end is the winner. To start, you draw cards and, and see who has the highest card. That person is the dealer. The person to the left of them will get to go first. Uh, so you deal out seven cards face down. This is uh, just to show how to play the game that they're face up. And then you put two cards face up in the center for people to play on. So if this person was the dealer, this person would get to go first. And the trick with dose is that number is what matters uh, and color is secondary. So there's a five and an eight out here, even though there's a green nine and a green 10 here, you can't play either of them on this five. It has to be a five. Uh, there are bonuses for playing a color that matches. So this player would choose to play this five and they can't play on the eight. They don't have anything that matches that or adds up to that, which we will get to in a minute. So whatever of the piles, if they've played on just one pile, that's what you remove. If he'd played on both, you would have removed both of those cards and put them in the discards pile. And a new card is placed out and this person can pick a card because they got a color bonus for it matching. They get to place another card out here. And now their turn is over and it is this person's turn to play. You can only play one card each time or you can only play on one pile each time. This is where some math comes in. Uh, this person has three that they could play on potentially. So there is an additional bonus if it both adds up to the correct number and is the correct color. You can use two cards uh, to add up, but only two. You couldn't do three plus two plus one plus one to, to add up something. It has to be just two cards. Uh, there are two specialty cards in this game. The twos are wild. They are any color, uh, which can be very helpful for getting that color bonus. And the number cards, they are there's number cards for each color in the deck, and those are any number that you need, which is also very handy. So this player has a lot of fun things to do. They can play seven plus one equals eight. They can play three plus number, so they're gonna choose that to be one, equals four. And the reason why they would do that instead of playing their one is because they got a double color bonus. They got a double, double color bonus because they got two of them. These stacks are discarded because they played on both of them. A new card is placed out. They get to place two of their cards out here because of how fantastic things have been going for them. And this player, if you play two cards of the same color that add up to, uh, the number out there. Not only do you get, does the player get to place a card out here, they have to draw one card, your, all of your opponents, for each time they've done that on a turn. So this person has to draw one, two, uh, which is a bummer. Uh, at this point, as play progresses, there can be more than two cards out here, but you only deal back up to having two out. So this player would get to play they're 10 and they get a bonus for that and a seven, put them off to the side. This slides over and no new cards are dealt out, but because they got a color bonus, they can put another uh, card out there and then play continues until someone has run out of cards. This person would win here. But if there was an occasion where they had a different number here, let's say they had, we're gonna do a tradesies. So let's say, they had this four instead, so they can't play out here. What you do then is you get to draw a card and you can play it immediately if uh, if, if it plays out there. 
If it does not play on one of those cards, you can just, this is a very forgiving game. You can add it to the end and your turn is over. Okay, and the most important part of this game, when this player had these two cards, if you have two cards and that's all you have in your hand at any point, you need to shout out Dose because if they didn't shout it out and this person said it first, then they would have to draw an additional two cards into their hand. If they got down to one card, if that didn't happen and they got down to this card and nobody said anything, you don't have to say anything when you have just one card. You don't have to say anything at all. Here's a quick walkthrough on scoring. If a player runs out of cards, the round ends. If they run out of cards while getting a double color bonus where the other players would have to draw a card, you draw a card before doing scoring and then everybody adds up their scores. So if they were just playing a two player game and this was the other person, uh, these cards, standard cards are just their face value. So this would be seven and three. The wild twos are worth 20 points and the wild numbers are worth 40. So this would be 70 points to the person who went out of cards would get those points. And officially the goal of the game is to get to 200 points first, but you can set your own point value that you're going for. So that's how you play Dose. It's Uno without the specialty cards and with a little more math and strategy involved. So enjoy. Thanks and see you next time from Game Like a Mother.